Let's talk about what the Bible calls the sacrifice of praise. Look at Psalm 107, 22. And let them sacrifice the sacrifices of thanksgiving and declare his works with rejoicing. 1 Thessalonians 5, 18. And everything give thanks, for this is the will of God in Christ Jesus concerning you. You know, when everything goes wrong and you still praise God, even though you don't feel like it, that's the sacrifice of praise. But let me tell you, once you start praising him, especially when you don't feel like it and everything is going wrong, that is when you will see miracles happen. Miracles either in the physical, but definitely in the spiritual, definitely in your soul. You know, when you say things like, I have this, um, these list of praises that I uh, often refer to. I just um, wrote them down as I was reading his word. Let me read a few to you. Jesus, you are so good, so faithful, so amazing. Your loving kindness is better than life. You are a good, good father. Your mercy endures forever. Nothing is impossible for you. You keep your promises. There is fullness of joy in your presence and pleasures forevermore at your right hand. <laughs> you are my rock, my fortress, my buckler, my deliverer, my high, high tower, my strength, and the horn of my salvation. You arm me with strength. You arm me with strength. You make my way perfect. You make me as a sure, as sure-footed as a deer, enabling me to stand on mountain heights. You are my counselor, my mighty God, my everlasting Father, my Prince of Peace. You take great delight in me. You quiet my soul with your love. You you rejoice over me with singing. You crown my year with goodness, and my paths drip with abundance. You clothe me with garments of salvation and cover me with your robe of righteousness. You know, as you say these things, write them down if you have to. I I wrote these things down. These are directly from the Bible. And I will walk around my house saying this to, to the Lord. And when I am through, my soul feels better because I'm reminding my soul. When I praise God, especially when I don't feel like it, I am reminding my soul what God is all about to me, about his promises to me and my soul, then it picks itself up. This is also like, uh, like King David did when he got into messes. He would encourage himself in the Lord, the Bible says. This is what you're doing. You are encouraging yourself in the Lord and you will feel much better. You will. You, this is how you restore your soul and just remind your soul that God has got this. And you're going to be okay.